Britney just posted a bombshell. I can totally understand why my family would have a problem with me doing my own thing. Maybe because I never have. I'm sure it is a little bit different and a touch lighter. Me not being responsible for three 18-wheeler trucks with tour equipment and thousands of people to be responsible for on tour. And Dad and my Robin in the corner of every room I've had to be in for the past 20 years. So, Jaden, as you undermine my behavior, just like my whole family always has, with, I hope she gets better. I will pray for her. Pray for what? I keep working so I can pay off Mom's legal fees in her house. Do you guys want me to get better so I can continue to give your dad 40 grand a month? Ah! Or is the reasoning behind you guys deciding to be hateful is because it's actually over in two years and you don't get any. Ah! I will say it. I sat in that kitchen and looked you straight in the eyes, beautiful boy, and said, how come I can't see you guys anymore? Or just see you guys more. I look forward to seeing you, seeing you guys weekly. You said, Mama, oh, it'll change. You and your brother left me in that house always two hours early. Preston would sleep. You would play the piano the whole time. And if I didn't shower you guys with gifts and have amazing food ready and play a motherfucking saint, it was still never good enough. That one time I asked you, looking straight in your eyes, I want to see you more. You called your dad. I never saw you again. I didn't do anything wrong, and I know I'm not perfect. But the love I've given you and how much I adore you and your diplomatic ways, speaking like Paw Paw, self-entitled, this can be fixed. I will see her when she's better. Jaden, it was a miracle I could even have a normal conversation when I got out of that place. But you were just like my other family. You secretly loved looking at me as something was wrong with me. I didn't need a family hiding shit in houses and whispering shit behind my back. Feeling subconsciously guilty because I paid for every fucking thing in both homes. I needed unconditional love and support. But guess what? The whole twist of it all. Which would have made a little bit more sense. I was in the greatest state I'd ever been. Because I was actually able to speak up 100% and say no. It saddens me not one of you have valued me, valued me as a person. You've witnessed me how my family has been to me. And that's all you know. Like I said, I feel you all secretly like to say something's wrong with me. Honestly, my dad needs to be in jail for the rest of his life. But like I said, mm -hmm. God would not allow that to happen to me if a God existed. I don't believe in God anymore because of the way my children and my family have treated me. There is nothing to believe anymore. I'm an atheist, y'all.